Welcome everyone. Hope you all are doing fine. Now, let us start. The first anime is it, The Promised Neverland. My parental rating for this anime will be 8.3. Its synopsis is as follows. When three gifted kids at an isolated idyllic orphanage discover the secret and sinister purpose they were raised for, they look for a way to escape from their evil caretaker and lead the OT. On to the next anime, we have Tokyo Revengers. My parental rating for this anime will be 8.0. Its synopsis is as follows. Hanagaki Takemichi lives an unsatisfying life right up until his death. Waking up 12 years in the past, he reckons with the eventual fate of his friends and tries to prevent an unfortunate F. On to the next anime, we have Awari no Sarafu. My parental rating for this anime will be 7.5. Its synopsis is as follows. In 2012, the world allegedly comes to an end at the hands of a human-made virus, ravaging the global populace and leaving only children untouched. It is at this time that vampires emerge fro. On to the next anime, we have Talentless Nana. My parental rating for this anime will be 7.0. Its synopsis is as follows. A group of super-powered children are gathered to prepare for defending humanity. One of them has no powers, but is in fact the emissary of a grand mystery. On to the next anime, we have Twin Star Exorcists. My parental rating for this anime will be 7.1. Its synopsis is as follows. Rokuro and Benio are named the future parents of a child of prophecy. But before they can have a baby, they'll have to raise a little hell. On to the next anime, we have Wonder Egg Priority. My parental rating for this anime will be 7.5. Its synopsis is as follows. While on a midnight stroll, a girl named Ai picks up an egg. A voice coaxes her. If you want to change the future, you only need to choose now. Now, believe in yourself and break the egg. Dot 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 dot. On to the next anime, we have Kimono Jihen. My parental rating for this anime will be 7.3. Its synopsis is as follows. Special Detective Kohachi Inagami is sent to investigate a grisly phenomenon involving animal corpses near a remote mountain village. But after meeting a strange boy, he discovers cursed sup. On to the next anime, we have Hunter Times Hunter. My parental rating for this anime will be 9.0. Its synopsis is as follows. Gon Free CSS aspires to become a hunter, an exceptional being capable of greatness. With his friends and his potential, he seeks out his father, who left him when he was younger. On to the next anime, we have Jujutsu Kaisen. My parental rating for this anime will be 8.6. Its synopsis is as follows. A boy swallows a cursed talisman, the finger of a demon, and becomes cursed himself. He enters a shaman's school to be able to locate the demon's other body parts and thus exorcise himself. On to the next anime, we have Jibaku Shonen Hanako Kun. My parental rating for this anime will be 7.6. Its synopsis is as follows. Hanako is an urban legend said to be the spirit of a young girl that haunts school toilets, but as Nene finds out, her academy's Hanako is actually a boy, and he is only one of many spirits. On to the next anime, we have Tower of God. My parental rating for this anime will be 7.7. Its synopsis is as follows. Reach the top, and everything will be yours. At the top of the tower exists everything in this world, and all of it can be yours. That's the end of this video, thanks for watching. Do like this video and share your opinions down in comments.